CXC is forging ahead with July's schedule exams, which has been delayed due to the COVID-19 pandemic. 30,000 students for CAPE and 120,000 for CSEC are expected to sit the exams, which now consist of a moderated SBA and multiple choice paper. French, Portuguese and Spanish students, plus human and social biology and visual arts, however, have additional components both at the CSEC and CAPE levels. E-testing will be conducted in the countries with the capacity, while paper-based exams will be available for other countries. Dr. Wayne Wesley, registrar of CXC, says health protocols of the individual countries are expected to be followed and expresses confidence in the exam method chosen despite the concerns of students' readiness. Uh, we would have done extensive analysis in ensuring that we are able to cover all the necessary skills and competencies and where those were, we were unable to assess those, additional components would have been required. So it is not just the multiple choice, but it is important to note that the SBA is also one of the modalities for assessing those critical skills and competencies. SBAs have been extended to June, and the Council is working with the various countries to iron out any issues. Dr. Wesley adds that marking will be done online if necessary for papers that require such, and teachers will not have to travel. While admitting to the psychological impact of the pandemic on students, the CX registrar says the reduction of the effects is their focus. The decision from CARICOM is clear. There is a date for the examinations now, and this is not a time to create any level of uncertainty uh, with the students or candidates who are being prepared. The examinations is July. As it relates to technology, as I indicated earlier, where the infrastructure challenges are insurmountable, then those persons will have access to the paper-based modality to write their examination. The results of the exams are due in the first week of September. I am Gerard Joseph for GBN News.